What do I remember um, of my early days? Well, I guess I remember a combination of excitement and fear. Uh, always thinking, I guess, you know, having this passion to create something and the desire to make things and build things. But also, of course, the fear that you may run out of money, you might not actually find the right people to do the right jobs, that things might go wrong. A uh, young designer can become successful, I think, through having passion understanding, um, I think probably a real clarity of thought and vision that they can bring to a, make a manufacturer so that the manufacturer can benefit from that special insight that they bring and understanding and hopefully together start the process of building a portfolio of work and be able to do something which is beneficial for the maker as well as the designer. When I saw this, the candidates I imagined of course, I put myself in their position, but I also imagined that um, I was a manufacturer looking at evaluating the work and finding the next talent if I, if that would change my company, my business, my life through them. That's how I sort of tried to evaluate it. So I, I was pretty tough, pretty tough on them. <laughs> I think a foundation like Be Open has the potential to transform the design the young designer's career, obviously. What I talked about earlier about this idea of excitement and fear, a lot of the time it's the fear that you can't carry on. And I think if you have, you know, an organisation who's prepared to sponsor you, to really give you the ability to lose the fear for a while, you know that you have a bit further to go. You know, it's just like, it's like just feeding the process in a positive way. I would like to wish the winners congratulations, a great deal of good luck and um, I would be very happy to share a glass of champagne with you later.